times you guys have played them, they've been very deliberate. They want to kind of slow things down for them mostly, but that also affects you guys. How much of a test is that for you guys, considering how much you like to get up and down the floor? Well, once again, it's a big, big test for us because I compare their ability to slow it down to A&M because they kind of like to do the same thing. And um, obviously, we didn't play as well as we would have liked to against them. So obviously, approaching this Vanderbilt team, they're they've been playing well recently. So we got to come out with the same energy and togetherness that we did at, at Florida. A little bit different from A&M, though. They like to attack outside in, if I remember right. They like to use the three-point line. What does that do for you guys matchup-wise, especially with Darcy in the lineup? Well, it's a, it's actually it's, it's a similar report to, to Florida in the sense that we really have to focus on their out, outside shooters. I know their, their guy, uh, Lachance, Lachan, I don't know if that's how you pronounce it, but he's similar to Frazier in that he's such a knockdown shooter. And just have to chase him off that line, not give him any open looks from three, and, um, and contain their guards because they're – they're more athletic than you think. I mentioned Darcy. What has he done these three games that, that you like? I mean, he, he doesn't jump off the stat sheet, but it looks like he's getting better at different things each start. He's, a, he's an intelligent person out there. He's somebody who, who really takes the time in practice to, to really know the kind of the inside stuff of, of how we play, like the, um, our offense. You know, he pretty much, he's, he's getting confident out there, and he's somebody who will always play as hard as he can. And um, the more he gets his confidence up, the even better you'll see of him.